Veterans retiring from the armed forces after serving for a set period are entitled to retirement pay. Additionally, veterans with service-related disabilities are entitled to disability benefits. But to prevent double compensation, a veteran must waive or forego an equivalent portion of his or her retirement pay to receive disability benefits. Veterans usually do so because retirement pay is taxable while disability benefits aren't. In Howell vs. Howell, we explore what portion of a veteran's retirement pay is divisible upon divorce. When John and Sandra Howell divorced, John was serving in the Air Force. The court classified his future retirement pay as marital property and awarded Sandra 50% when it became payable. John retired a year later and, per the divorce decree, sent Sandra half of each monthly payment he received. Thirteen years later, the Department of Veteran Affairs concluded that John was partially disabled and was entitled to certain disability benefits. To receive his monthly disability benefits, John waived $250 a month of his retirement pay. As a result, Sandra's 50% share decreased by $125 a month. Unhappy, Sandra filed suit in Arizona Family Court, arguing that John should be required to continue paying 50% of the pre-waiver amount. The family court held in Sandra's favor. The state appeals court affirmed. And the Arizona Supreme Court also affirmed, holding that because John's waiver occurred after the divorce decree, federal law didn't prevent Arizona courts from requiring John to reimburse Sandra for the waived amount. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.